Greetings, YouTube. Farmer Son Prepping here. Hope you're all doing well today. Uh, today is Black Friday. I know most people are at the stores doing the Christmas smash and grab. <laughs> uh, forgive my noisy floor here. I got a floorboard that squeaks. Uh, in the shed today. It's, it's a beautiful day in Alabama. Let's see if y'all can see that. Sun shining bright. How about that? Swing it around there on the old, uh, what's it called? Tripod. Uh, so yeah, what I want to talk about today is don't wait till next year. Black Friday and the whole everybody shopping thing got me to thinking on what things am I going to be needing to buy next year. Uh, I know already I need a new, uh, water hose or a garden hose we call them hose pipes in the south y'all uh but i need a new garden hose the one i've got has already got three hose menders on it <laughs> so it's past time and i have you know i have dogs and uh i use my hose to fill up the dog water bucket and the water plants in the summertime so uh it's time for me to get a new garden hose i realize like walmart and places like that have already put up all their um their garden stuff so but you can still uh find stuff like that at like ace hardware or whatever lows so i'm thinking that's something i need i need to go ahead and buy that now uh so what are some things y'all y'all foresee you're going to need uh in the next year uh do you have a project in mind are you going to paint your deck or you know, whatever it is you need to buy things for that now if you're going to paint your deck, buy the paint now. Buy the brushes and the rollers now. I've read so many different price increases that are coming into effect in January of 22. So if there's anything you can get now for next year, we need to be doing that. As preppers, we're not the ones that are in the final minutes in the crowd scratching after toilet paper. We're preppers, we stay ahead of the curve. Uh, we get those things early and so we don't have to be there fighting and clawing to try to get one thing left on the shelf or whatever. So what do you need for next year? Maybe you need some sandpaper. Maybe you need some, uh, some pipe fittings. Uh, maybe you need some more tools. Uh, yeah, I'm just looking around the shop. Maybe, let's see. Maybe I need some more chain lube for my four-wheeler chain. Uh, maybe you need some bar oil for your chainsaw. Uh, might need some of that or whatever your brand is. Uh, fix a flat, brake fluid, uh, you know, motor oil, uh, Two cycle oil, whatever it is you're going to need, you foresee yourself needing, uh, needing in the in the coming year. Uh, you need to find those things and buy them now because so many things are fixing to go up by twenty percent or more. Uh, so, well, hey Ripper, you decide to come in here and join us. The dog just showed up, y'all. Hey buddy, I'm talking to the tripod here, okay? Uh, but yeah, that that's kind of what I'm wanting to do this video about today um also let me pop y'all out of here we'll discuss this while we're doing it well it's the two for one video here y'all i started uh scouting out i took the four wheeler out for a ride yesterday me and the dogs got out in the woods started scouting out some uh some places to camp uh since i got the four wheeler fixed the other day and I've already started packing my wagon up. Uh, as you all can see, there's firewood up under here. I've got some real nice dry seasoned firewood up under here to get my fire started with. This is my big tarp that I put over my tent. My tent is right there. Uh, my pad, sleeping pad. And so I'm starting to, I've got my hatchet in there, my machetes in there for, you know, in case I need them. Uh, trying to think what else I've got in there so far, but, uh, I'm working on packing up the wagon this time. 
I'm going to put straps on everything. As you can see, I've already got some on here. These are this year's standard motorcycle straps. But this is some stuff I'm working on, getting ready to do my next camp out. Uh, everything is still very wet. Sorry, y'all. Let me get you back over here. Uh, so, uh, all the scouting I did yesterday, uh, I only had two two real choices because of everything is so wet. A lot of things are underwater right now. And plus, we just got rain last night, Thanksgiving night, so it rained here for several hours. But uh, I think with a few more days of sunshine, one of my two options will, will work. And we can get out and test my four-season sleeping bag and uh, get out there and do some SHTF practice, a.k.a. camping. So... Not really looking forward to the sore back and all that, but I'm looking forward to getting out there and with this new tripod attachment and all, being able to film it a lot better, hopefully. So, along with that, remember to think for uh, think about things we're going to be needing next year. Go ahead and get those now, whatever that might be. And hey, I appreciate y'all watching. I appreciate all my new uh, subscribers and viewers. Uh, I think this video will come out, I'll probably do it on Sunday because I've got a live stream set for tomorrow, so I'll just stack it Saturday. I think it'll start around 10 o'clock in the morning. Been having some success with those. Uh, people seem to like the morning live streams, the late morning live stream for me. Uh, but, uh, Remember Romans 12, 21, uh, be not overcome with evil, but overcome evil with good. I've uh, been forgetting to say that a few times. Uh, while I'm on here, Psalms 23. God bless you, brother. Praying for y'all, what y'all are going through over there. Thank you for the wonderful videos. Uh, enjoyed those. And uh, let, me, let me tag this. It just struck my mind. Next Tuesday, I believe it's the 30th of November, we're going to have a Talkie Tuesday, and I'm having special guest Bullfrog Swamp Homestead. He's going to co-host with me. So I think that's going to start at 10 a.m. So uh, be there for that. I'm looking forward to having a good discussion on that day. I think we'll have some good uh, prepper discussions and survival discussions on that day. All right. Long enough video. Uh, this is Farmer Son Prepping, y'all. Appreciate you watching.